to eradicate global hunger and malnutrition, I really think we need to accept science and technology. There are so many tools that are available to us, um, like bioengineered products and, and gene edited products that are drought resistant. And it just it increases the yields. Um, it makes sense for the environment. It makes sense for the, the food that we're producing and the people who are consuming it. So I think science and technology really is a huge piece of the puzzle to solve malnutrition and hunger. Um, I think there's, there's also this need to know where our food is from. So I think there's a transparency element with that. I think we should be honest and open about where food is from, educate folks, you know, wherever they are, and make sure that they have all their questions answered. But we can't do it without advances in science and technology. And many of them are, are available. We just need to implement them and use them um, to the, the best use of the global, the global community.